character. Woke up at 11 o'clock, I ain't got no job. What the hell should I do today? This feel like some I don't give a fuck. Oh my god, shut the fuck up, I ain't hearing what you gotta say. What the deal, how you feel, not important. All I'm thinking about is riding in these Porsches. But don't be coming at me with that horse shit. Acting like you know me, that's the worst shit. I know in my soul. Step up, messed up. up. Well, I've been and done when I tense up. They patients were now playing dress up. Big sales on them big meals. Got a pocket full of coupons, we going on well. And you know I got them refills. Got my dimes and the coffee vents playing on the JBL. Daily, I don't go to sleep unless the sun is up. Think I'm wasting all this time, feeling kinda stuck. Not enough. Reps only cast who the fuck does legs now. Way too busy, feeling stressed out. I'm just trying to get ahead now. From the school, so I woke up at 11 o'clock. I ain't got no job. What the hell should I do today? This feel like some I don't give a fuck. Oh my god, shut the fuck up. I ain't hearing what you gotta say. What the deal? This right here is my wall of wonders. You may wonder where did I get this wall, and I'll tell you, I pay. $500 a month for it. <laughs> this wall was the biggest challenge for me with framing, with hanging, but at the end of the day, I persevered. So now you have this to look at every once in a while in my videos. <sighs> oh God, get me off. My thighs. My thighs are gonna get wrecked. Ah, my thighs got wrecked. Ah. Uh. With this corner right here, you will see a tapestry, which I got because I didn't think I would have enough wall art. But fun fact, I ordered way too much wall art. It worked out in the end, but this corner had to happen. And I think it's cute, but the lighting here really doesn't allow its pure potential cuteness. So I can only really enjoy it in the nighttime. This is my rug. Did I know that it was gonna ruin the white balance in all of my photos? Yes. Did I care? No. Because I wanted something bright and yellow, and I got it. You can't stop me from doing what I want. Cause you're not my real dad. I'm calling this the shelf of chaos. I genuinely don't know how to make it look good. Interior designers, hats off to you. I don't know how you do what you do. So if you see the shelf looking a little questionable, mind your business. Now you might be wondering, what does she think about this wall? It's perfect. It's beautiful. I love it. If you say anything mean about it, this is the real trouble. I can't keep this desk clean and or organized. And let's face it, it's and. <laughs> These drawers, oh, don't look inside. It's disgusting. This right here is my only line of defense. This is the only thing I can keep organized. See, look, all of these are the same. Ooh, wow. This is my cat. Does he try to scratch my mirror and eat it because he thinks it's his? Yes. Do I let him? Um, yeah, because he is useless and can actually do it. Oh God, that noise though. I just want him to look at himself and be sentient, but he refuses and he's trying to eat the paint off of the mirror. That's my son. I have had a decorated office for only five days and it's time that I tell you guys the truth. It's already a mess. My office was already a mess. My drawers were never organized to begin with. <laughs> The truth is, it was all a facade. None of it was real. My office was never perfect, and it never will be. The God honest truth is that keeping this shit clean is impossible. But today, we're going to try and resolve it. <gasps> Hi! This is a serious matter, Artie.
Now that you've seen the reality of the situation, now we must redeem ourselves. we have all of the things that I want to use regularly. Fine liners, Crayola super tips, colored pencils, a bunch of miscellaneous markers, Tombows, and a bunch of pens that I use for my planner. I found that keeping them on my drawer or keeping them on top of my desk made it so I was either anxious because my desk was too cluttered or I never used them because they were tucked away in my drawers. So I got this cart from Goodwill for literally a dollar. A dollar. For this row, we get a little less accessible. We got my chapstick, my binder clips, the jar I use for water, another jar that I use for clean water that currently has my go-to color scheme that I'm practicing with. And then we have pens and things that I want to use more often. For this row, we have sketchbooks, iPad, and headphones that I use regularly. And then we have decorations over here that I use for flat lays. Down here we have a big box of crayons that I collected when I was a kid. I wanted to try to get more into these so I could make a video about making artwork for cheap. I haven't gotten around to it, but it's down here because I'm hopeful. Those are the final results. That was today's video. I hope you enjoyed. If you like it, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I make videos at least twice a month. If you want to see more, follow me at Yinkish on Instagram, and I'll see you next time. Bye!